All right, 643 is the time right now. We are continuing to track Hurricane Helene. This is a live look at Helene from a satellite view as it moves closer to making landfall in Florida's Big Bend region right now. Tonight or tonight, we're making it uh, in tonight. Uh, Mary Bell Gonzalez joins us now live from Steenhatchee, Florida, which is about 90 miles west of Gainesville, right off the coast and 167 miles north of Tampa. Mary Bell, uh, good morning to you. Uh, so in, in the final hours before it makes landfall, what does it look like out there right now? Yeah, good morning. As you can see, the rain is slowly coming down. We saw this start yesterday afternoon, continue off and on through the evening, back on again this morning. And the concern here continues to be the flooding, as you can see. Uh, you can see definitely why that is the case here in Stinhatchee. We are standing over this dock of the Stinhatchee River, and we're told that in just a few hours, this could be uh, underwater. And we know that Floridians here, they're used to preparing for these kinds of uh, severe weather events. Uh, a great example of this in Tampa, right outside of Tampa, I should say, in Hudson, people were loading up on those sandbags, helping out their neighbors, distributed them to the neighbors, uh, elderly neighbors, and those with disability neighbors, helping neighbors stocking up on supplies as well at the, at the store uh, in preparation for these catastrophic effects. All right, you mentioned how people are, are getting ready. Uh, also, the um, the lead officials there, some of the some of the leaders in the county and the state are saying people should evacuate. Some are mandatory evacuations. Some are are voluntary evacuations. Are they listening to these warnings? The ones who can get out, are they getting out? You know, for the most part here in Stinhatchee, we have seen uh, that people have been following those orders. Uh, the streets eerily quiet. We know that businesses shut down early yesterday in preparation for today's potential landfall. Uh, but there are those residents that are used to these uh, to these severe weather events. Those people are hunkering down. Uh, but we have spoken with some residents, including one right here uh, at this hour, just sitting across from where we are right now, who says he is heading out of the area because it is intensifying, as we mentioned. And so definitely people are heeding those warnings. All right, Mayor Bell, thank you very much for reporting from uh, Steenhatchee, Florida. We appreciate it. Uh, be safe out there. Uh, thank you. WUSA 9 Weather Impact is sponsored by Morgan & Morgan.